Simplify the square root of 15 over the square root of 6. Two things happen here. Thing number one is if I give you something like the square root of a over the square root of b, I'm allowed to write that as the square root, one big square root of a over b. I'm allowed to do that. Why am I going to do that? Because I can write this out as the square root of 15 over 6. And I know that 15 over 6 simplifies to 5 over 2. I can divide the top and the bottom by 3. Great. Does that mean I'm done? <laughs> no. Let's write it back to the way it kind of once was where we have a square root over a square root. There's some stupid math rule that I still don't understand why, even though I've been teaching math forever, that says you're not allowed to have a square root on the bottom. You can't do it. So what we are going to do is a process called rationalizing the denominator. In order to make that square root go away, what we can do is multiply the bottom by the same exact thing. If I have a square root of 2 and I multiply it to the square root of 2, the square root of 2 times itself is the square root of 4, which is 2. However, we know that when we deal with fractions, we can't just multiply it by a number. We have to multiply it by a number that equals 1. So I'm going to multiply the top and the bottom by the square root of 2. That makes this root 5 times root 2, which is the square root of 10, over, again, I'm going to explain, and I'm going to show you what I did, the square root of 2 squared. Okay, root 2 times root 2 is root 2 squared. Now, a root 2 squared means that the root and the squares cancel each other out, leaving us with the square root of 10 over 2. Now, before you start thinking, oh, great, this can become 5. Nope. The square root of 10 is a square root. The whole thing lives within the square root. 2 is no longer a square root, so these guys have nothing in common with each other now, and you can't just simply divide. What I do have is I have a fraction where I don't have a square root in the denominator anymore, which means it's a legal problem. Okay? And there you have it. Dividing square roots. Fun.